Bob. <laughs> oh my god. Keep going, keep going. All right, oh, yeah, just, oh, just, all right. This is how you set up a snowboard. Um, this is how you install snowboard bindings onto a snowboard. All right, here we've got Jackson boots that have the BOA coiler system, sweet lacing system, really quick. And then we've got the Ride EX bindings, two of them. You need two bindings to set up a snowboard, just so you know. And then we've got the Ride Antic snowboard. This is a great board, by the way. Anyway, first thing you need is a screwdriver. And second thing you need is, well, snowboard boots and bindings. So, go in your binding box, lift up the flap, you see you have your accessories here. Your binding plate, screws, leash, etc. Plates. And your bag of screws. Now with the EX bindings, you have to take off the foot wedgie first, which is this right here. It says wedgie. And to do that, you take off this screw, I don't know if you can see that. Mm -hmm. And that's the only thing holding on the foot wedgie besides the fact that it's slipped over this little plastic casing right there. This is definitely the most difficult part. Anyway, pop the screw out, slide that off there, and now you are wedgie free, which is a good thing usually. Um, so do that for both bindings. Now, what you do, you have the wedgie out, take your base plate, slide that in, and we go from here. If you had a Burton board, for example, there would be a different way to install that. The base plate you would turn to the side here, um, like Ride shows you on their little custom flap right there. <clears throat> and that's, oh, sorry, that's how you would line it up, but we will do another video about that a little later. So anyway, you got your holes right here, it doesn't matter which hole you pick, pick any hole. What we recommend doing is standing on the board first, putting, and just stand naturally. And however you stand, set up the bindings from there, or place them anywhere from there. Um, so based on the way that I ride, like 15 degrees in the back, and you can see the little degrees, they're marked every, well, 15 degrees here. Each little hash mark, by the way, is three degrees, not one, not two, it's three. And now, I'm putting the bindings together. <clears throat> it's as simple as putting the screws in. I put two in at a time, especially if you're doing it for somebody else. So then, put in two bindings, put in two screws at a time, and then if they don't, doesn't fit right stance that is, then you can always rearrange it. Good, how are you? Good. Looks like we have a customer. <laughs> Please believe that. Right there. Right. And this is installing. I ride Goofy, this is a Goofy setup by the way. I'm not saying that I am Goofy, but that's how I ride. If the screw doesn't fit, don't force it. That's very important. <laughs> How are you? I'm good. I just want to grab a couple stickers and I'm good to go. <laughs> All right. We'll be right with you. No problem. Up, slide that wedgie back on. How's it going? Good. 
your guys' business doing with the economy going to crap? It, it hasn't been People bad. Still wanna... Hasn't been that bad. It hasn't oh, been good. that bad. It's been slow, but not. People still want to ride. Yeah. Thankfully. You always want to ride. Yeah. yeah. And that's how you install the binding. Yeah. Call that.